This is question 13. College Board gives us a quadratic equation and asks for the distance between the x-intercepts. So I have f of x equals x squared plus 5 x plus 4. I can just write that as y because we're more comfortable with that. Although f of x and y mean essentially the same thing. To find the x-intercepts, I'm going to factor. I have x and x. I need two numbers whose product is 4 and their sum is 5, so that would be 1 and 4 and they're both plus. If I check with FOIL, I get x squared plus 4x plus another x is plus 5x plus 1, so that is the correct factorization. The x-intercepts occur when y equals 0, so I have a product that equals 0. That's why we factor quadratics to find the zeros. So either the first factor is 0, x plus 1 equals 0, subtracting 1 from both sides, x equals negative 1, or if a product equals 0 and the first factor is not 0, then the second factor has to be 0. x plus 4 equals 0. Subtract 4 from both sides. x equals negative 4. The distance between x equals negative 1 and x equals negative 4 is negative 1 minus negative 4 is negative 1 plus 4 equals 3. Choice C. College Board often requires you to factor quadratic equations or apply the quadratic formula to find the solutions, the x-intercepts, the zeros. So make sure you've reviewed your quadratics, particularly if it's been a while, and come back soon for my next video. With math, there's always more.